So what I always do is when I when I talk about spectroscopy is that I compare it to uh, infrared uh, cabins. So if you go to a sauna, sometimes you have this infrared uh, rays that will will give you the heat. And what we do is we use that radiation to study molecules so on the molecular level. And we actually we um, send light, infrared light, for example, or visual, visible light into the molecule. It will do all kinds of things. It will absorb it. It might uh, scatter some light back. It might do something to the light. And we detect what, whatever is happening, basically. And my research is, is focused on um, studying uh, how antibiotics behave in three dimensions, because that will give us something, or it will give us a clue about how it will interact with a biological target, like a bacteria, and then kill it, for example. It gives us hints about what parts of the molecule are important uh, for the interaction, for giving its three-dimensional structure, and basically what parts you need to keep in order to build new uh, mo yeah, drug molecules or, or possible drug molecules. And, and for example, if you develop a certain um, antimicrobial resistance, or resistance towards a medicine, you could actually change it a little bit so that it becomes more resist well, it becomes more effective again against the bacteria. Mm -hmm.